got a great email question came yeah. in on our topic, uh, came in earlier in mm -hmm. the week, came in from uh, two weeks ago from Parker. Uh, Parker says in his uh, email to you, Matt, I'm a small business owner and most of my employees are W-2. According, you know, he's got his employees and this is how he does their wages is W-2, not 1099. Does that matter? Parker, the answer to that is yes. Why? Is that a big yes or error? It completely matters, Parker. Absolutely it matters. Essentially, to qualify, to qualify to get money back for your employees, they have to be W-2 employees. And they have to be full-time employees with the IRS. And the IRS defines that as like 136 hours per month. And so absolutely has to be a W-2 employee, has to be a full-time employee. So actually, for example, as I touched upon the 100 employee um, kind of limitation, Kenny. All right. you know, some of my clients said, well, I've got, you know, 130 W-2 employees. Well, are they full-time employees? Right, yeah, yeah. And when we look and we look at their literally monthly, you know, wage statements, they're not full, they're not according to the IRS, full-time W-2 employees. So it drops the number down. So okay. they do qualify. So these are the kind of things you look at and you have to know to look at to make sure that you got a good claim. Well, and that's a good point about the full-time too, because you can have a sure. part-time employee that's a W-2, but that wouldn't qualify underneath this program. Absolutely. So, so you don't IRS, count them. So the IRS is trying to reward businesses that when you kept your employees on full-time, during the pandemic. Kind of did the right thing. Small yeah. businesses, and as you can say, they limited it to 100 and lower. Uh, and so, you know, big national conglomerates obviously can't do this, thank goodness. So it's for the small business. And that's me, that's probably a lot of folks listening tonight. Sure. And that's why we're so excited. That's why we're trying to get the word out. And just truly amazed that, you know, this is something that really was not on our radar literally five, six months ago. And we're still talking to clients daily and it's not on their radar either. And, and, and so we just want to make sure that we get the word out and people look at it because it's a great program. Matt, if somebody was interested in learning about this for the first time on the show, uh, or going to check us out on YouTube later in the week, yeah. uh, what do they need to, what do they need to have in front of them when they call your office on Monday or Tuesday this week? Honestly, they just need to communicate with our office, Kenny, and then we send them a small packet that they have to fill out. We need some basic information and what we do, you know, you cannot call me on the telephone and I can say, you've got a great claim. Okay, yeah. I don't know. You got to see it. There's some basic paperwork. I need to see it. And then we kind of go down this road together. We do a no obligation look, meaning we don't charge anything until the point you say, yeah, I agree, Matthew. We do have a good claim here. We're going to file it. We're going down this road together. And then you've got something. Otherwise, we're happy to look and say yes, no, and people do as they wish. What? And I want to go back over the end. So it is a when you take the first look at it, the meter's not running. Absolutely. It's a free examination. Free look under the hood, no obligation whatsoever. Absolutely not, because honestly, I don't know. I mean, I've got to look at you your paperwork, and then we kind of give, we come back with an estimate. We come back, we think you pass causation. We think you're good here. Right. Do you want to proceed? And then if they do, fabulous. And then, as I say, we, you know, we don't get paid until the client gets paid six sure. months afterwards.